Hi everybody, it's Allie with Allie Artifacts. Um, I just wanted to kind of jump on here and uh, let you know about something that I'm going to be doing um, coming up. And I am, <laughs> I have papers in front of me. I'm going to be reading from this uh, thing because I wrote it up ahead of time so I could remember everything that I need to remember. Um, and um, in case... <laughs> In case I get emotional about it, because I do that, um, you can ask my children. <laughs> um, so I am participating in something called Scrubby Sunday. So, um, and what that is, it's uh, basically an effort to make washcloths, <clears throat> excuse me, crocheting or knitting or whatever else, I guess, um, for homeless veterans. And it's through an organization uh, called American Starfish. Um, and what they do is uh, they're working on providing housing, food, clothing, that, that type of thing to over 100 veterans um, and uh, homeless vet veterans, actually, uh, and, uh, at a location there in, in uh, Arizona uh, where American Starfish is. Uh, so you can go to the website. It is uh, theamericanstarfish.org, and you can kind of see the plan for what they're wanting to do and the, um, the homes and things like that. They call them tiny homes, but they're nice little houses are either, they're lovely. Um, so, and you can kind of see the vision of what they're wanting to do. And I'll put all that information in the description here. Um, so I heard about all of this through Christina's Crochet, Christine at Christina's Crocheting. I mentioned her on my channel before. Um, she's a lovely, lovely person. Uh, she has, she's got her own channel of uh, wonderful craft or crochet things and and that kind of stuff um and uh, yarn goodness and, and that kind of thing. But she was talking about it. She's participating in it. Um, and I'll I'll put her link in the uh, um, in the description as well. Um, so no, I guess she was watching Heather at and I have to look at the oh, so it's called Strings and Threads. Strings and Threads. Um, that's her channel is Heather at Strings or it's Strings and Threads Heather at Strings and Threads. <laughs> so she kind of started this because she was contacted by American Starfish uh, to do this, and um, she kind of felt like. This is going to be a lot. Sorry, my cat's coming in the room. I don't know if you can hear her meowing. Um, but, you know, she thought it's going to be kind of a lot. So I want to go ahead and, you know, ask for some help. So she did that and it's kind of started into a thing. Um, there are, including me, um, 10 channels participating now, if not more than that. She might not have updated uh, her information the last time I checked. Um, so it's called Scrubby Sunday. She kind of made that up. Um, and what she does is she just kind of shares the, um, uh, the wash class that she's making for the veterans. And, um, uh, I think it's like three or four a week, you know, something like that just shares what she's doing. And then I don't know how often she's sending hers out. Um, but you know, she sends them out regularly and, you know, and, and gets it to them. So, um, what, Oh, so I will have the information about how to participate in this if you would like to do that. I'll put that in the description as well. There's going to be a lot of information in there for you. Um, so <clears throat> I wanted to kind of talk about my why for why I wanted to do this. Um, you know, in my immediate family, I did not have uh, anybody close who was in the military. Um, but my husband's dad was in World War II. Um, he was a World War II veteran. Um, I had, you know, uncles who have since passed. They were in World War II and Korea. Um, I have a cousin who was in Vietnam. David Mark, I don't think you're watching this, but if you are, hi. <laughs> Love you. Um, but uh, um, my dad, you know, he, he was deaf, so he was not able to um, join the military. Um, but he always wanted to be in the Air Force. He always thought that would be kind of cool. Um, but he, he really instilled in us a pride for our country. Um, and, you know, to this day, my mom supports, um, uh, you know, different veteran uh, ministries or whatever, you know, you want to call that. Um, and, and we just, you know, had that in us that, you know, you support the military. So in my mind, you know, they gave their lives for our country. Um, this is where I get a little emotional. <laughs> um, the very least that we can do, the very least that I can do is to make something that can be used in their daily life that um, will hopefully bless them and hopefully help them to know that somebody cares. So that's why I wanted to do it. So every Sunday uh, between now and November 11th, um, that's kind of the due date for when the washcloths are due, which I think is kind of cool. It's Veterans Day. <laughs> um, I I'm going to be sharing what I'm making for the week. So um, and it's, again, it's going to be maybe like three or four, um, that I'm, that I'm going to make each week. 
I'll talk about the stitches I use, the type of cotton, you know, all of those things. Um, and then once a month, I'm going to send my packages off to um, American Starfish, you know, and, and I'll just do that like on a monthly basis. Um, and if I did my calculations correctly, <laughs> which I think I did, if I do four a week, that's going to be 72 washcloths. So I'm thinking, you know, 72 is like, wow, that's a lot. Are they going to distribute it, you know, to all of the hundred and all these other people that are doing it? You know, I kind of got to thinking about that. It's like, but you know what? You don't always, first of all, need just one washcloth. You know, you need more than one washcloth. Um, but also I think that I'm kind of getting the impression that American Starfish doesn't just do the stuff that they do for the, for the homeless veterans right there. I have a feeling that they kind of have a wider vision. Um, so it's going to be used in, you know, in something good. So I just, uh, um, I'm excited about participating, you know, in all of that. So stay tuned uh, for Scrubby Sunday. Um, I really, really appreciate everybody who's uh, stopping in and watching. I am so sorry if you can hear my cat. <laughs> um, she's, she's a little agitated or something. Um, she's an older cat, so she gets agitated sometimes. Um, anyway, but yeah, so thank you so much. Thank you for stopping in. Thanks for, for uh, hanging out with me. Um, stay tuned for, for Scrubby Sunday. It's going to be, it's going to be fun. I think it's going to be really fun. So, uh, thanks. God bless you. And I will see you around the tube. Take care. Bye.